welcome back to the channel family you already know what time it is gang gang we in this thing make sure y'all hit that subscribe button to be a part of crew smash that like button to see what it do y'all okay so let's get into this reading for you this is going to be for my um leos let's see what the energy is like um we're doing life path reading so we're going to see if you guys are on the right track what advice i can give you guys to get it, you guys on the right track um what it is that you guys might be going through you know stuff like that so let's break it down let's see if you guys are on the right path whenever it comes to your life and then also where your life path might lead you. Or what is it that you're supposed to be doing? What's your purpose? Let's get into it. All right. So you guys have the angel of love and the healer of the ages. Okay. Which is saying that you guys have to learn how to uh, learn how to grow from always seeking so much attention and looking for opportunities. This is what um, you guys might have in terms of holding you back is the fact that you guys have a tendency to be opportunists or also be seeking attention or um, doing some of both. Okay. And with the storm warning card, this one being in reverse, you guys have to work on chilling with this rest and rejuvenation card and not being so chaotic with the um journey card this one being in reverse this is what causes people to distance away from you and not want to deal with you and this is what causes negative energy to mess uh, manifest for you and for you to have to work so hard with the sun card whenever it comes to love relationships or just trying to keep people around you all right Also, Leos, you guys have the third chakra, Archangel Camille, the Envy Core in reverse. Okay, so Leos with the seven chakra, Archangel Uriel is saying that right here, whenever it comes to your life path, it will be wise for you guys to sit back and make better choices whenever it comes to um, being emotionally balanced. So you guys got to work on emotional balance. And with the seven chakra, Archangel Uriel is saying that it will be wise for you guys to be more observant whenever it comes to what it is that you desire. So you guys need to sit back and observe a little bit more, not sit back and go for your desires or just go based upon a feeling. OK, with the broken heart card, this one being in reverse, you have to let go of feeling envious. So you guys have to let go of hidden jealousy <coughs> whenever it comes to your desires. So you guys deal with a lot of situations to where you guys get jealous of other people, what they have, and feel like you guys are like kind of like in competition with individuals. You guys got to uh, break out of that and work on being emotionally balanced, whether that be in terms of dealing with your emotions, in terms of anger, aggression, or whatever, and then also in terms of jealousy as well. All right, and you guys have the male holding the heart and the door to spirit. Okay, so with this action card, it's saying that you guys need to learn how to connect more with your higher self. With this male holding the heart, this one being in reverse, also connect with people in terms of making emotional connections. With the strategy card and the action card, you're going to find out that a lot of the things that you do aren't going to um, manifest for you whenever it comes to your plans or the shit that you want to do in life. So you guys got to take more time to try and like figure yourselves out and understand yourselves. All right. And then also you guys have the old tied up card and the thinking man card. This one's in reverse. Let's see what's going on. All right. Leo's right here. You guys are manifesting a lot of y'all are all over the place with the old tied up card. You're not doing what it is that you say. Okay. So it's like you guys not um, y'all not being too focused right now. So this, it sounds like Leo's, you guys are definitely off track. You guys are not focused. Y'all are all tied up. So y'all are tied up in whether it be a ton of relationships, whether it be a ton of just shit that you shouldn't be tied up into. Okay. But it's like, it is, it's too much. Your life is a little bit chaotic. And with the man holding the coin and appreciation card, this one being in reverse and the door to romance, it's like your love life could be chaotic because it's like you guys fall in love with what it is that you could get out of a person. So, yeah, y'all are just all over the place, headed in the wrong direction whenever it comes to love and just life in general right here. Leo's, y'all got to get back on track. You guys have the appreciation card. This one's in reverse and the deceit card. You guys have a lot of individuals to where they have to work on forgiving you guys because with the appreciation card, that one being in reverse, you haven't shown enough support or appreciation for the people around you. And Leo's. You guys, whenever it comes to your path in life, okay, you're not aware of the fact of, based upon the way that y'all think, 
and how y'all so based upon y'all reaction y'all being too reactive whenever it comes to the things that you value this could cause you to be a little bit indecisive and this could cause you to be a little bit indecisive whenever it comes to long-term relationships building friendships relationships um family members and things like this this could cause people to be indecisive whether they should come into your life or not whenever it comes to long-term relationships so based upon the shit that you're doing right now you're building up a whole bunch of situations or uh karma to where individuals will be kind of like looking at you and looking at your life and kind of being like i don't want to be a part of it because of the fact of what it is that you value or the individuals that you value like i said you guys have the all tied up card so y'all are like kind of all over the place you might have multiple relationships going on and this is what's going to cause a person to be hesitant in terms of coming towards you you're going to find right here that whenever it comes to your directional path just by you being unorganized in your life in general it's going to cause your like y'all are just y'all like y'all not gonna be able to see the direction that y'all need to take in life so it's like y'all have to um y'all got some work to do hold on y'all got some work to do especially because it said that y'all not focused so y'all need to go back go meditate go take a sip of water <laughs> figure things out All right, Leos, you guys, you guys have the movement card. This one's in reverse and the loyalty card. Okay, so you guys aren't going to take action towards being loyal with the belonging card. You have a sense of not feeling like you belong whenever it comes to relationships. So with the fledgling card, it's saying that um, there's going to be some new things here. Okay, so it's going to be some new changes in your life. Things are going to be out of control with that summon card. And with the denial card, it's like you want to start to realize that Things are out of your control and things are a little bit chaotic whenever it comes to your life. So this is what you're about to see. So Leos, I'm going to need you guys to get less chaotic, try and get organized, fix things in your life, whether it be with your relationships, whether it be just with yourself, okay? But you guys definitely have some work to do in order for you guys to be on the right track. All right, so hopefully this helps you guys out for today. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Okay, my bad. I forgot to add this last part on, which was to see um, purpose for you guys in terms of like what is it that you guys need to do? What purpose are you fulfilling in terms of your life? Like, why are you here type situation? Okay, so let's get to it for Leos. <clears throat> Okay, so with the Sixth Chakra Archangel Metatron, you guys are here to bring some sort of awareness. So it looks like whenever it comes to Leos, you guys are going to be the example setters. So you guys are going to make people aware of the fact of they shouldn't be chasing or forming relationships or caring about individuals whenever it comes to money. With this angel of love and the uh, patience card, you're going to teach individuals how to become more patient based upon your frustrating circumstances. You guys are going to teach individuals to be more attached based upon your level of attachment within your relationship. So based upon you having a bunch of broken relationships and going through karmic situations, you're going to teach other individuals how to um, become stronger whenever it comes to love or relationship wise with the financial constraints and the contract card like i said teaching individuals not to get into relationships for love not to tie themselves down for love and with the garden the gate card this one being in reverse showing individuals how not to act based upon how you guys act in certain situations so it's like leos you guys are going to be the example setters for what not to do uh whenever it comes down to it all right um uh, sorry leos but it's like at least by you guys going through all these trials and tribulations it helps you guys to give other people advice but um it seems like you guys are here to be more to build a level of awareness so it's like you guys are here to like learn a lesson go through a couple tests in order for you guys to learn a lesson you know um help other people to be aware, help to bring other people um, awareness in terms of the situations that you went through. You might be able to show other individuals how to navigate through those situations, okay? But unfortunately, Leos, you guys are going to go through a whole bunch of BS in order for you to gain this amount of awareness, in order for you to be uh, able to help other people. All right, but you will go through a lot of situations to where you might end up having to help yourself first before you're able to help others. All right, so hopefully that helps you guys out for today. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out.